All right, this is my first melodic marble run. I've got six notes, C, D, E, F, G, and A. I took apart a toy xylophone and 3D printed some pieces to hold the keys. And I've actually got a full two octaves of tone bars, so subscribe and stay tuned for a lot more songs to come. So this track got a little bit uh, more complicated than I expected. It would have been quite a bit simpler if I had made multiple copies of the same note, but I wanted to see if I could do it with just the six notes, one of each. So let me just kind of walk you through what all is happening here. It starts with three balls, two red and a green. The two red balls are going to play the first couple notes in the song. They both come down pretty quickly and play two C's twinkle. And pretty quickly they get into this first switcher, which one of those red balls is gonna hand off to a different red ball, and they're gonna both continue and play two G's twinkle, twinkle, and then enter these turntables. After playing a G, go play an A. And after they play the A, that third ball, that green ball is coming down, it's been taking its time, and it's, it's primed to play the G again. So you get twinkle, twinkle, little star. And then those red balls <clears throat> are going to finish, or almost finish, the phrase, how I wonder what you... And now for that last note of the phrase, that green ball again, that, that third ball is going to get reset on a scoop and then a cannon and come all the way back up and play the C one more time. And that completes the phrase. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Now for the next line of the song, that ball is going to trigger a, uh, another set of three balls. And two of these balls, these green balls, are going to play the next line in the song. So they're going to come down and play, up above the world so high. And notice those turntables are now set in a position such that the balls will go straight across them. They're not going to play an A after playing G. They're going to go straight to F. These turntables are kind of tricky. I actually had to work this one out on paper uh, before starting to build anything. Okay, so now let's rewind and go look at that volcano, that blue ball. My blue balls are always used as trigger balls, so they're not going to play any notes. So that blue ball gets sent over uh, to another trigger, and that trigger's got another set of two green balls and a blue ball, and those two green balls are going to play the next line of the song, which is exactly the same as the previous line. Like a diamond in the sky. And uh, again, on that last volcanic explosion, there is another blue ball, and that blue ball is going to slowly make its way over while the notes are playing, and that blue ball is going to trigger another explosion, and that explosion uh, <laughs> it's, like, it's like the ring of fire over here. There's so many volcanic explosions. So let's follow one of these at a time. The first one here um, gets uh, knocked over into another volcano, which has three blue balls. And these balls, their entire job is to just reset the turntables. So they're going to descend pretty quickly over to this spiral and enter the turntables at different points, uh, different places, so that they reset the turntables back to the starting configuration for the final lines of the song. So then if we rewind uh, two explosions ago, uh, we get to this other blue ball, and that one's gonna slowly work its way down this path uh, to then trigger another volcano. And when I have these really long chains of balls here between the magnetic cannon and the volcano, that's just to kind of uh, guide the, the trigger all the way up, um, makes it a little bit more controlled. So this very last volcano here, this is just a repeat of the song. It's basically putting the balls in the same path as the very beginning to play the final, uh, the final two lines. So the two red balls come down and both play uh, twinkle, twinkle, little. The green ball comes down and plays star. And then the red ball is, how I wonder what you... Now that green ball is getting reset again on a different scoop in canon to come back and play the very last note. How I wonder what you are. And again, this uh, this uh, this interesting switch combination here after that C, that red note, um, it's basically allowing <clears throat> two balls to hand off, uh, but the third one not to hand off. And so uh, that last ball gets stuck right there, and that ends the song. Okay, so let's reset the whole thing and play it one more time.
All right, thanks for watching. Go ahead and subscribe if you want to see some more melodic marble runs, and I'll be back soon.